What is going on everybody and welcome back to Mad Detailing. Today's video is on the Chevy Cruze and by the looks of it, it's not too bad. There's a lot of staining and like nicotine tar everywhere, but it is the smell this vehicle has that brings it over the top. It smells like an entire grow house in here and now my entire shop smells like we are doing a different type of business than just detailing but don't worry in this video we're going to make this vehicle look absolutely brand new by removing these seats and the carpet giving this car the deepest clean we possibly can if you guys are new to this channel make sure you guys like and subscribe i post brand new videos every thursday at 12 p.m with that being said we're going to go ahead and roll these before shots and get right into this disaster detail Moving on to cleaning the wheels, we're using our Extreme APC on the tires and fender wells, and for the wheels, we're using our Mad Acid along with multiple different brushes so we can make sure we get every inch of this wheel and tire 100% clean. And if you guys have yet to try our Mad Acid, I would highly recommend checking it out. It works extremely well on wheels. It works amazing on water spots on your windows and your showers in your house. It works extremely well on a lot of different surfaces to remove rust such as, you know, brake rotors, exhaust, etc. So if you guys would like to try our Mad Acid or any of our detailing products, head on down to www.maddetailingusa.com. I'll also leave a link in the description to our website along with a coupon code so you guys can save 20% off your entire order at checkout. Before we can move on to a contact wash, we need to get the vehicle sprayed off. So we're simply using our pressure washer to blow off all the loose dirt and debris before foaming the entire vehicle down with a foam cannon and our mad detailing super blue soap. And then we will hand wash the entire vehicle with a soft microfiber wash mitt. All right guys, so I am in the works of creating a sweepstakes giveaway for you guys. In the sweepstakes, winner will receive a 1983 Datsun 280ZX with only 66,000 original miles. This is honestly one of the cleanest Datsuns I've ever seen in my life. And now you guys are gonna have a chance to enter to win it. So if this is something that you guys would be interested in, please leave a comment down below. I would love to hear your feedback.
Moving on to the interior, the first thing I need to do is move all the trash, anything that is too big to be sucked up by the vacuum, before giving this carpet a nice pre-vacuum before getting it pulled out. And honestly, I probably didn't need to pull it out of this vehicle, but it takes an extra five to 10 minutes and it honestly makes extraction a lot easier. But if you're just detailing your vehicle at home and your car is not bad at all like this one, I would not recommend taking your carpet out because it just isn't necessary. And moving on to the seat extraction, I'm using our Extreme APC as a cleaner, followed by a Milwaukee drill with a drill brush attachment. And for the extractor, I'm using my Mighty HP60 hot water extractor.
And moving back to the outside, before we do any type of polishing, we need to clay bar the entire car. And for this, we're using our mad detailing clay loop and a synthetic clay bar. And then we are going to polish the vehicle with our Rupes Mark 21 polisher, a orange medium cut polishing pad and HD speed. No, that's not gonna be a full correction, but it is gonna remove a lot of swirls and scratches, leave behind a nice high gloss shine and leave behind a decent protection. 